Hi everybody, it's Lainey and welcome back to Lainey Tutorials. Today I'm going to be doing a really quick like book review and I'm going to be doing it on the book Loot, How to Steal a Fortune by Jude Watson. This book is really good and I definitely recommend it. If I would have to rate it on a like one to five stars chart, I would definitely um, rate it like four and a half stars. It's In this book there is a famous cat burglar named Alfie and, and Alfie has a son named Demarch. And Marsh basically helps him with all his burger learnings because Alfie steals like jewels, famous diamonds, like famous emeralds, all stuff like that. So Alfie helped me, Marsh helps him like escape and just helps with him and stuff. And Marsh lives with um, Alfie. So one day Alfie was doing a heist and he was on the roof and Marsh was a little late to like help him escape on his bicycle. And Alfie fell from the roof through Marsh a moonstone, which is a kind of a magical stone and I'll tell you more about that later. But he threw March a moonstone, and he fell, and right before he died, March was right by his side. Alfie told March to find Jules, and of course, um, March doesn't know who Jules is. Um, Jules, March is thinking it's just like actual jewels, like diamonds and stuff like that, and rubies and all that. So that's what March is thinking. Jules is actually his twin sister, which I'm not going to tell you how they find each other, and I'm not, I'm not going to tell you how they're, they were separated. But, so he eventually finds his twin sister, and he has to leave his dad, because his dad told him all these rules about stealing and stuff, and just never be caught by the police, so he had to run away from his dad when he saw the police showing up when after Alfie fell. So he finds his twin sister named Jules, and they kind of meet more friends, just two more friends, and they all go, and they have a prophecy that they're going to die. March and Jules are going to die. So the only way to break that prophecy is these moonstones. And the moonstones are like magical things, like magical stones that can break prophecies, they can tell prophecies, and all of that. They have to find all the moonstones, and of course they're all separated, and many different people have them. And they have to go steal them and plan heists to steal them. Of course March has he doesn't really have experience, but his dad has told him lots of things about like high schools. His sister and their friends don't really have experience, but he they're all making plans and they all have really well thought out plans. I don't know, I can't tell you if they're going to break the moons like break the curse and find all the moonstones. Basically, they just have to break the curse and find all the moonstones to break the curse. But other people may want to find the moonstones too and other people are looking for the moonstones to so again other people are also wanting to find the moonstones and they are planning heist too this book is about march and jules and their crew going and planning heist and stealing all the moonstones and trying to break the curse i can't tell you if they are going to break the curse they might they might not it's very intense it's very good though so it's definitely very intense and intriguing, and I definitely recommend it. If you love adventure, it has tons of adventure packed in this book, tons of like intensity, tons of just lots of fun stuff, and I definitely recommend it if you love like that. And it's also like a mystery book too. So I hope you like this book, and I hope you go read it because it's really good. And I hope you liked my book review, and if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you would like me to do more book reviews, just put down in the comments below, like, what book? Because I like hearing new book recommendations, and I like reading books, so just tell me that down below in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Lainey Tutorials, and just thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.